Hey guys, um, I have a story that I want to tell you, but first I want to preface it by saying that anybody and everybody is capable capable of doing great things. Um, many of us don't because uh, because the world around us tells us that we're unable, that we're we're, we're not good enough, um, that we're not talented enough. Or, you know, we, we, we made mistakes in the past and it, we're, we're kind of, we, we're, I guess we're kind of jaded by that or, or we're, just, we're just held back by that or we're ashamed or whatever. But those things are untrue. The world around you will tell you that you can't do it, but the God inside of you will tell you that you will do it if you want to do it. Um, so back to the story. Uh, when uh, a few years ago I was put in jail, um, I, was, I, I committed a bad crime. They tried to put me in prison um, and said I went to jail. I didn't really believe, like, I re- didn't really believe that I belonged in jail, like a lot of guys that are in jail. Um, and, you know, and I would, every day I would pray to God to, uh, to you know, like, to let me go today. I want to go home today. You know, but... The, the reality of it is that if I had gone home when I wanted to go home, um, I would have gone straight to the gas station, straight to the bar, I would have, who knows, and I would have, would have gotten really good and drunk, um, which would have been a disaster for me at that time. Um, but I got a, uh, I had a Bible in jail, um, it was a King James Version Bible, which if you've ever tried to read a King James Version Bible, do not get discouraged. It's actually, it's written, it's very difficult to read, um, the way it's written. Um, so anyhow, I had a King James Version Bible, and, and I read a, a passage from from Luke, I believe it's 2242. Um, and it basically, it's, it's talking about the, the night before Jesus was put to... Uh, was crucified, was put to death, and he went up into a, to like a, a, a room where he could be alone, so that he could pray to God, to his Father, um, and, 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 and basically what he says is that, Father, if you will take this cup of suffering from me, however it's your will, not mine, be done. You know, I thought about that, and that hit me. That 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 was, you know, I, I realized I've been praying all wrong. I've been telling God what to do. You know, God does not need me to tell Him what to do. He knows what He's doing. He does not need my help. So I started praying like that. Um, you know, I started telling God. Um, I started saying, God, you know what I want. You know that I want to go home. You know that I don't want to be here. You know, I don't think I deserve to be here. I don't belong here. However, if it's your will that I be here, then, 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 then help me, um, help me learn what I need to learn from this experience. Um, and shortly after, and I started praying like that every day, and shortly after, um, I, uh, I, I got, was woken up very early in the morning um, by uh, by an officer, and he told me that I need to go to to, uh, to court, to the courtroom, to talk to my judge. And I thought, this is it, man, this is it. I'm going home today, and I was like skipping down the halls of jail and stuff. When I get to when I get to court, um, the judge tells me that she is sending me to substance abuse treatment. Or rehab, if you watch uh, watch VH1, um, alcohol rehab. And I'll tell you what, man, I was pissed. I was mad. But that was the best thing that could have happened to me at that point. Because, like I said before, if I had gotten that, when it, when my plan was when I got out of jail, I was gonna go get drunk, I was gonna get tore up, and and probably and I would have ended up right back in jail if not dead. Um, 
But I went to, to, to treatment and I learned about myself. Um, by the way, my name is James. I'm an alcoholic. Um, but I learned about myself and I learned that I can't drink. I learned there is more to life than, 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 than alcohol. I learned that I could enjoy my life without drinking. And I got out and it was like the best, that, that was the best thing that could have ever happened to me at that moment. See, I was telling God what I wanted and telling him when I wanted him to do it. And God does not work on my schedule. He does not work on my plans. He does not do what I tell him to do. So then I started um, telling him, you know, your will, not mine. But just please make, just don't let me miss a lesson. Let me learn whatever I have to learn from this because I don't want to be back in jail. And he did. God is good, guys. God is good. You all can be good. You're all amazing people. You're too blessed to be stressed. Um, stop living in the past because it is not, it doesn't have to hold you down. Today's a new day. It's a beautiful day. And let's add beauty to it. You guys are great. Talk to you later. Bye.